Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is H3 Productions. Um, today, I'm going to show you how to change your background of your Xbox 360. Basically, you can change um, your dashboard theme to anything you want it to be, any picture that you have. Um, you can make that your new background for your dashboard. So basically, all you're going to need is your hard drive for your Xbox 360. Um, an Xbox 360 transfer kit. Um, you can get that from Microsoft for like 10 bucks. Um, you're gonna need uh, two programs: Export 360 or Explorer 360. Um, uh, I've done a modding tutorial before, and I just like to point it out. For me, Explorer 360 does not work with my 20 gig. It does not see it. So maybe for some people it does, some people it doesn't. I don't know, but Explorer 360 works with 20 gigs. Explorer, I don't know. I have, it hasn't worked for me yet. So either one, if it works for you, they both do basically the same thing. So Explorer 360 and Modio, and I'll have a link to download both. Um, as of right now, Modio is hard to get a hold of because. Um, it seems as if GameTots.com is where you get Moldio from, and it seems like they're under a denial of service, a DDoS attack. I don't know, their website's basically inaccessible, I barely can get onto it. Maybe now it's better, but um, I was barely able to navigate through to grab it, but I'll throw it on file front for everyone else so you can easily get it. So basically just plug in your Xbox 360 hard drive using the transfer kit, um, and then open up Export 360. Text, expand, partition 3, content, and then it seems like the long string of zeros, and then look for, um, it seems like it's, in this case, I said in my mod tutorial before, something about letters are not always the same. For people in this case, it seems to be FFFE07D1. Now, whatever it says here, it says Atari Logo 1, theme or gamer tag. It, that happens to be different for other people, but this is the same. So you'll click that. you look for 0030000, this one right here. And you know it's the right one because we'll see right here. Theme, theme, so these are my three custom themes I've already made, and then all your other random themes. So we'll keep that open, minimize, don't close it. Let's open up Moldio, and this will take a while to load. I mean, even with my new computer, my quad core, it still takes you know considerable amount of time. Um, should load it pretty well. All right. Um, Go to M, other tools, theme creator. This is very straightforward. Main image, media library, game library image, and system settings image. Kind of says it all. The main image basically be what you'd always see. So I'd say put your most favorite image first. I have a bunch of pre pictures, so I'm just going to throw a few in there. I'll just say. Um, uh, media library, I'm just going to throw them in there. Load, basically just load images. And then, these are just different colors you can put. I'm just going to keep all this to default, and then you just name it whatever you want. I'm just going to go whatever, and then you're going to go create theme. And then it's going to save to your desktop, so the theme name is what it'll come up as your Xbox file name is just you know doesn't really matter save it and I'll just tell you yay we've created an image alright then go back to export 360 let's drag it on to our uh, hard drive through export and it is as simple as that and now we'll go check it out on the dashboard. All right, uh, let's check out the theme we just made. Let's basically just go through here, change theme, and choose your next theme. 
it is as simple as that. So you just check out video library, system setting, set your custom picks. So anything you want, any pictures, uh, yeah, you can throw on your Xbox. So anyway, hopefully uh, you found that pretty helpful. Thanks for watching.